So, how does the Large Hadron Collider work? The process begins by feeding beams of protons into the collider from a chain of small gas pedals. Each proton began its journey in a simple bottle of hydrogen, where electrons are stripped from it, leaving bare protons ready for acceleration. These protons pass through a series of gas pedals, gaining energy at each stage until they finally arrive at LHC. Once in the collider, the proton beams are boosted to finite energy levels, reaching the 6.8 tera electron volt mark during the latest 2024 launches. This intense energy is necessary for the protons to collide with sufficient force to decay into a range of subatomic particles, some of which may never have been observed before. The whole process takes place on a scale that's difficult to comprehend with everyday analogies, but we'll still try to explain the concept fully. One tera electron volt is roughly equal to the kinetic energy of a flying mosquito. Thus, 6.8 TeV is akin to the total energy of about 6.8 flying mosquitoes. However, that energy is packed into a particle that is inconceivably smaller than a mosquito. The proton is a subatomic particle, meaning it's part of the nucleus of an atom and has a diameter of about one femtometer. 